I am Mr. Anam. Thanks for joining. Today, let's play with the energies of luck and uh, some of the magical realms and the magical beings like uh, leprechauns and the connection to shamrocks and pot of gold and everything. And all of these, um, you know, you can think about these as stories or mythology, but the idea is that tens of millions of people are holding that field of consciousness around luck and connecting to uh, shamrocks and leprechauns and pot of gold and rainbow and everything. So when you tune into that collective field of luck and take advantage of those energies and harness those energies so that you can use it and receive it and allow it to spiral through you and shift your reality, then you know you can bring in more luck and abundance in uh, all areas of your life. So let's simply play and um, I will connect you with a field of luck. Uh, you can tune into that field anytime with your intention. Just play and connect daily and just notice how things begin to shift. Focus on your heart. Gently close your eyes and begin to breathe in and out. Let's bring up spiraling earth energies from the center of earth and allow these energies to come up through your lower chakras and your feet for grounding. and allow the spiraling rays of the sun to come down through your higher chakras and your crown. Allow these energies to spiral through you up and down, creating a vortex between the earth and the sun. Just tune into your heart's energies and begin to tune in to the energies of luck. Think about lucky people. Think about lucky solutions and luck favoring you. What would that reality look like? And what would that reality feel like? That's the reality where everything works out for you. And everything works out for you with ease. And luck always favors you. Abundance and possibilities show up all the time. And you allow yourself to receive a stronger flow of luck and abundance energies in your life. I will now connect you with the field of luck. You can imagine this field as a sphere, as a gigantic sphere. And think about connecting with it or tuning into it or touching it. And then gradually entering this sphere that's filled with the energy matrix of luck.
let's bring in some of those energies through your cells and through your DNA strands. Notice your sensations. Notice the thoughts that are popping up. And notice anything else that may pop up for you. Let's go deeper into this field of luck and make it stronger for you. Focus on opening your heart to align with the cosmic flow of luck and abundance energies. As the energy from the field spirals through you, begin to dissolve your resistance to allowing luck and abundance. Whatever happened in the past, let's choose to let them go. We don't need to get stuck on all those stories and justifications. Let's design a new world moving forward. Allow the vortex of luck to get stronger. Tune into the collective consciousness around the luck energies of the leprechauns and shamrock and pot of gold. Notice golden coins everywhere. Notice golden coins filling up all of your bank accounts and they're overflowing with golden coins. Raise your 
upper limits around allowing and receiving luck and abundance energies. Break your old limits. Open up the flow. Notice the energy vortex is getting stronger and stronger for you. It's spiraling through every cell, through your DNA strands, through your chakras and meridians, through your atoms. You're becoming one with that field of luck. Simply tune in to that field of luck. Begin to vibrationally resonate with those energies. Allow the energies to integrate for you. Let's breathe in and out deeply and gently a few more times. Come back to your present moment. Rub your hands together and gently open your eyes. But thanks for joining. You can play with these energies and this meditation or journey anytime and just connect with the field of luck, play with those energies. And the more you are playful, the more you can notice different things opening up, different options showing up. Yeah, when you are in resistance, then the focus, the full body and consciousness focus is about all the things that are not working. Instead, let's be curious about possibilities and just ask questions like, I wonder how I may have a lucky day. You know, I wonder how luck can be always on my side. So ask those kind of questions that are about curiosity and that uh, those questions make your brain um, focus on something that's about luck and abundance and prosperity. So let's keep playing this way and have fun. And let's um, continue to play with all the tips and uh, let's um, you know uh, focus on having a magical year. Take care.